While Microsoft has its own photo app built into Windows, many users say that it's heavy and bloated, with some complaining that it crashes quite a bit. So coming up, I'll count down the top five photo viewers for Windows we've tested, all of which are free and a lot better than the built-in Windows Photos app. Let's get started. First up, coming in at number five, is XNViewMP. This photo viewer and image management program is popular with users that want to view multiple images at once in a single tabbed window. It has extensive support for image formats, including RAW files, and it allows for various ways to view your photos. There's a thumbnail view, full screen, film strip, and you can also create a slideshow. Its interface, while still looking somewhat dated, has improved quite a bit over the years. There's a basic photo editor built in to resize and crop. It also lets you adjust the brightness, contrast, color levels, and you can apply filters and effects. To easily convert multiple files to a different format, a batch image converter is built in. XNView MP is free for personal and educational use, in addition to Windows, it's also available for Mac OS and Linux. Next up, coming in at number four, is Faststone Image Viewer. This powerful photo viewer is great for image editors and photographers. It supports most of the popular image formats and is packed full of features. Some of those include various color management tools, editing features, and allows for viewing histograms. The primary reason I keep Faststone installed is that it has an excellent full screen mode. With an image in full screen, when you move your cursor to the left, it'll open a side panel that lets you easily access its editing features, adjust the colors, and add effects. Coming in at number three is Image Glass. This feature rich and lightweight photo viewer with a modern looking UI is for those of you looking for an image viewer whose performance is superior to the Microsoft Photos app. It supports more than 70 file formats and offers various ways to view images along with a limited set of editing features. Of all those mentioned in this video, Image Glass does have one of the best user interfaces. What I like is the menu at the top with the modern looking icons to get quick access to the various features. To personalize how it looks to you, icon packs and theme packs are also available to customize it how you want it. I do want to note, when you go to download Image Glass, it will give you two choices to get it. If you download it from the Microsoft Store, it'll cost you a one-time fee of $9.99. If you want to get it for free with the option to donate to the developer, select Get Image Glass Classic. Then to download it to your computer, select Installer. Before we get to our top two, here are some other photo viewers, which are also free, that might be of interest to some of you watching. First of which is Nomax. Available for Windows, Linux, and Mac OS, this lightweight open source image viewer supports unique file formats, including RAW and Photoshop's PSD files. Available on the Microsoft Store, Quick Look is similar to the image viewing capabilities on Mac OS. By simply pressing your spacebar, it gives you a quick preview of the file's contents, including with some of Adobe's file types that can't be done with most other image viewers. Vism Photo Viewer is similar to Image Glass, which I mentioned earlier. It's open source and lightweight, opening files quickly, but does have less icon packs and themes when compared to Image Glass. Handy Viewer is a photo viewer that's also capable of playing videos and includes a basic photo editor built in. It supports more than 150 image and video formats. The last of our bonus picks is Google Photos. While there is no dedicated program for Windows and can only be accessed in your web browser, it does offer a cross-device experience for viewing and editing images with dedicated apps for iOS and Android. In the runner-up spot coming in at number two is PictureFleck Photo Viewer. It supports all of the popular image file formats, and unlike most photo viewers, even supports GIF files, which can also be pronounced GIF. I've given up, I don't care how people pronounce it anymore. It's a really fast image viewer built on the UWP framework, and it's feature packed with touchscreen support on Windows computers. It has a fantastic, minimalistic user interface with the settings, tools, and other features clearly labeled at the top. 
while the free version of PictureFlect does offer all of the essential features most people would ever need. They do offer a pro version for a one-time $5 cost with additional features, including thumbnail view, transition effects, and the ability to play and export videos. Coming in at number one, the best free photo viewer is Irvin View. This has been my default viewing app for years. It's the most lightweight of any photo viewer with a footprint of only six megabytes. It's available to download on Windows 11, going all the way back to Windows XP on both 32-bit and 64-bit systems. It has a ton of features. Some of those include a dark mode, tools to edit your images. It can convert your image files and includes batch processing. Basically, many of the functionalities are similar to the older version of the Windows Photo Viewer before they screwed it up. The only downside is that the user interface does look somewhat dated. Other than that, I have no complaints. If you're not a fan of the default toolbar on Irfan View, they do have tons of toolbar skins available on their site to download. To sum things up, if you're trying to get away from the miserable Microsoft Photos app, you do have better choices that are less bloated with more features and better performance. Thanks for watching. Links to the programs mentioned are in the description. If this video was useful for you, give it a thumbs up and share it with others. What is your favorite photo viewing software? Let us know about it in the comments. And if you're new to our channel, subscribe and click the bell to not miss out on our latest top fives and other tech related stuff.